Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm taking a yoga class. We're doing it in my living room. Basically, we're gonna be doing a 15 minute yoga full body stretch for deep relaxation. And you're gonna come with me just to see how this all works out because I haven't, I haven't taken a yoga class in a very, very long time. So I think starting at home is smart for me because I haven't taken a class. Also, I don't have a yoga mat, so I would look pretty odd if I showed up to class in person without a mat. But I'm here, so no one else except for myself. So, and now everyone who sees this. But yeah, let's just do some yoga. Welcome. This is a 15 minute deep full body stretch. Feel free to have some props nearby, like pillows, bolsters, yoga blocks, anything that you may need if you feel like you might. We'll begin in a wide leg child's pose, just taking the knees as wide as you possibly can. And we'll thread the right arm under <laughs> the left of the mat. This is supposed to be calming. This variation is of course you have the option to skip this pose if it does feel uncomfortable. Yeah. And switching sides. It's already hurt. You can't even see me. Dang, this is not comfortable. Whatever. We'll begin drawing. On an exhale, rounding through the spine. Oh, I love this Take your gaze down for cat pose. Inhale, dropping the belly. Take your gaze up for cow. We'll continue sinking breath with movement, flowing at your own pace. Go ahead and come to a neutral spine, walking the hands forward. Begin to gently rock side to side. Maybe finding some organic movement here. Oh, this is not side to side, but okay. You're sending the hips towards your heels, rounding through one vertebrae at a time. Cobra pose, option to rock side to side. Oh my God. Gazing over one shoulder, over the other. Remember to live through the sternum, soften the shoulders. So you're getting that full stretch for the entire front body, tucking the tailbone to protect the lower back here. On an exhale, tucking the toes, pressing into the hands. Walk it out here, finding some organic movement. You can twist side to side, just pressing the mat away from you. Remember to really ground into the mat, pressing the mat away from you. Let the head be heavy, no tension in the neck. Left leg lifts. Exhale, taking the knee and the ankle to the top of the mat. Option to place pillows underneath the hips. Underneath oh. the left hip on the front of the right thigh. For added height and support. Feel free to skip this pose if it doesn't feel right. You don't want to feel anything more than just a gentle stretch. Option to rest up right here or go ahead and take your fold. Holding over the left leg. We'll begin drawing the back into see. the belly. Usually you think all dancers. As you exhale, have, allowing the hips to be yeah. heavy. You just think all dancers. Softening have the legs. Crazy softening that right knee. Flexibility, but um, right I'm. Right foot. Letting go of any tension. I'm one of those people that exhale. wasn't born flexible. For my back is very injured. My hamstrings aren't good. My hips aren't all of it. So this is, I think I, I'm just gonna sit up. How long are we gonna be here? When you're ready, gently release, tucking the right toes, sending that left foot back. Coming right into your down dog, walk it out. Your next inhale, right leg lifts. 
Exhale that right knee and ankle to the top of the mat. Inhale, lifting through the sternum. Might even in the frame. release, tucking the left toe, sending that right foot back, down dog. Walk it out here. Placing the right heel beside the left hip, so the right knee is pointed forward. Oh. And keeping that left foot just on the inside of the right knee. If this is enough, stay right here. Oh, I hate this. Foot tall. Left knee, left hand just behind you. Oh, so Once again, sitting nice and tall, look through the sternum as much as you can. As you exhale, soften the shoulders. Inhale to release. And we'll switch sides. Why is she doing that? Left heel rests beside the right hip. As you exhale, take that left elbow to the outside of the right. Do you see how dramatic she is? Right hand in back. Gazing over the right shoulder, sit tall. Okay. And we'll come to a comfortable seat. Inhale the hands up overhead. Exhale, side stretch towards your left, right hand reaches up and over. Inhale the hands back up. Exhale, side stretch towards your right. Inhale, reach the hands up. Exhale, release the hands down. Inhale, big breath. Reach up. Exhale, release. Inhale, reach. Exhale, this time hands to heart center. Thank you for joining. Namaste. Mm. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit the bell icon so you don't miss any updates on future videos <laughs> on the stream. That hurt. So I think that's a sign that I need to be doing more. It is a sign. I know it's a sign. I know I need to be doing more. But now we're going to make a smoothie. And you're going to come with me to make my favorite smoothie. Okay, that is all for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed me struggle in yoga and be in pain and make my smoothie. Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you can't tell by the... Bleh. Her voice is peaceful. I can say that.